Level two, I tore both my Achilles and my goal was to see if I could push through and get back to the athleticism and be able to dunk once again. Now I'm at level three of the reasoning behind why I continue to work out. So while playing basketball, I've already torn my left Achilles tendon. Now I've torn my right. Do I quit or do I keep on going? Come take this walk with me. Let's find out. devastated knowing exactly what I have to go through tearing my Achilles for the second time how long strenuous of a process process is gonna be <sighs> I'm thinking in my mind I cannot do this once again I decided once again to push through it to see how far I could go see how resilient I was so I pushed through a second surgery six to 12 months of recovery. My goal this time was to be able to dunk once again. So I was gonna do everything in my power to get back to being able to dunk. It took me about three years and I was finally able to dunk again. There was a light at the end of the tunnel and I got to it. So level one, I was starting to work out because I wanted to be the best player I could be. Level two, I tore both my Achilles, and my goal was to see if I could push through and get back to the athleticism and be able to dunk once again. Now I'm at level three of the reasoning behind why I continue to work out. Now I don't want to be a hypocrite. My goal as a basketball coach is to practice what I preach. So I can't tell the kids that I coach to continue to work hard, be the best player you can be on and off the court, continue to train, go to the weight room and all that good stuff. And I'm sitting at home eating chips, watching Netflix and just overall being lazy. Deep down in my soul, I just can't live with that feeling. Just something in my spirit that just won't allow that to settle right inside of me. I continue to work out and I've made it to level three, which is now living for others instead of living for myself. It's crazy because once you start living for others, it feels like life just opens up so many endless possibilities. So I'm at the point where I hope I continue to inspire and motivate others and continue to inspire and motivate myself with the things that I can do. Instead of asking you guys to subscribe to my channel, I'm gonna leave you with this question. I want to know what motivates you guys to work out? Why do you continue to work out to this day? What inspires you? Was it something that happened in your life that changed you? Have you just always been into working out? Leave it in the comments below because I'm very interested to see all of your point of views. Big shout out to all the supporters who were there with me from the beginning. And I'm so glad to have all the new ones that I've gained over this month. You are the ones that keep me going. And without all of y'all, I honestly don't know where I would be. So thank you once again. Till next time, this is Coach Kev. Purpose Driven, Backdrop, and I'm out. Peace.